Firehouses have good food. So what do you get when three Detroit firemen open up a pub? Hmm, Michelle Oliver will show us as she takes us to St. Clair Shores to dine in the D at the Firehouse Pub. Fighting fires and getting together to make delicious food is all in a day's work for a fireman. It's a tradition. We cook two meals at the station every day, lunch and dinner. But Brian, along with fellow Detroit firefighters Jack and Mike, took it one step further. When their pensions were cut, they decided to open up their own restaurant, the Firehouse Pub. Brian, myself, and, and Jeff were uh, talking one, one time on vacation out in, down in Florida about you know doing something steady you know, when we're done fighting fires for the rest of our lives, and uh, it popped up. We are bar people. We like good food, we like good drinks, we like uh, to you know have a good time, and this place came in, just was like a blessing. Loving what they do, they wanted to reflect that in their restaurant. Their drinks are called extinguishers, and there are pictures of local firemen hung proudly on their walls. We wanted to make it more um, fire-oriented, so Brian, my partner, did a lot of the fire pictures that you see around here. We have the Buell Building fire in, in, in here. We have the, the Tiger Stadium fire picture. As far as all the shields around, you can see they're all the nearby cities, you know, St. Clair Shores, Roseville, Warren. So we showed them our appreciation for the, not only us being Detroit firemen, but for all the other cities that are around us. And just like in a firehouse, the food here is made from scratch and will leave you craving more. What brings the people in we knew was gonna be the food. So when we opened up, we, we, we hired one of the best chefs we knew to create a menu that was made mostly from scratch. Kind of like we do at the firehouse. You know, it, it isn't just fire food. You can come here and get a meatloaf that's just outstanding. You can get salmon, hamburgers. Our lunch menu is, you know, wings, Rubens, you, you name the sandwich, we have it. One of the favorites here is the award-winning Bash Burger. We start by seasoning the burger with salt and pepper. This is really thick. It's a half a pound. Then onto the grill it goes. We put a weight on it to keep the burger from shrinking. Next comes the pork belly. It's basically bacon before it's cured. Also on the grill, we toast up the bun and some jalapenos. They get kind of flavored like the pork belly because we use the same utensil. Yeah, all the fat rolling off from the pork belly. We're going to have pork belly jalapenos here. Pork belly jalapenos. Give me an idea. I just <laughs> want it named slightly after me or reference me in some way. <laughs> Once the burger is grilled to perfection, we top it with some Fago Rock and Ride barbecue sauce, the jalapenos, and some smoked Gouda cheese. Then we let it melt. Look at that, oh, so melty. We finish it with grilled pork belly and some onion straws. It's served with a side of garlic parmesan fries. I really enjoy uh, when the place is crowded for football games and baseball games, and everybody's cheering for the same team, and. It's almost like a bar where everybody knows everybody. Joining us today in studio are the owners of Firehouse Pub. That's Mike uh, Urban and Jeff Smith. Good morning to you, gents. Good morning. Good morning. So you guys have history. Let it out. Well, I've been to the Firehouse. Yeah, he's been oh, okay. multiple times, live in the D and stuff like that. So, yeah. yeah. All right. So let's get into the food. Uh, what we have here is our, our, our famous uh, pulled pork nacho. It's got... Uh, our Fago uh, Rock and Ride barbecue sauce on it, outstanding. We probably sell every night 10, 20 of these every night. They're outstanding. Um, next, we hit uh, we hit a home run with this one. This is our bash burger. We won the burger bash with this uh, in Royal Oak. It's uh, it's a uh, that's our garlic parmesan fries. Also, this also carries our Fago Rock and Ride barbecue sauce. It's got a pork belly, uh, jalapenos, uh, smoked gouda. Uh, fantastic burger. Uh, the mac and cheese is what, kind of what we're known for. Uh, also, smoked gouda with applewood candy bacon. And our cheese sticks. Everyone looks at these and then we call them cheese logs. Um, yeah, these are, these, are, these are incredible. We hand roll them, we hand make them. So they're, they're, they're really good sellers. Uh, really very, very, very filling. Uh, we sell a ton of these also. And it's football season, so we brought our Asian lime wings out with our uh, apple or our, uh, our blue cheese uh, coleslaw. That's, uh, these are five of our, our dishes that we sell quite a bit of yeah so these are some fan favorites when people fan come favorites. into the restaurant yeah. but you guys have some other really cool stuff on the menu so I just want to point this out because I'm coming just to eat this what is this glory is that like a steak with potatoes and oh that, look at that what is that, that, is that right? mushroom gravy that is our that. meatloaf with onion strings on top of it okay and when we opened the first restaurant we looked at the chef and said meatloaf and a sports pub 
It is the best meatloaf you'll ever have. It's a hit. It, it's it's, it's grandma's a meatloaf. It's so great. If it tastes half as good as it looks, <laughs> it, it really it does. is. It's it a does. winner. It's a, it's a we know how to eat. I mean, take yeah. a look at us here. I mean, let's, let's be honest. <laughs> There's not a lot of meals that we've skipped, but that is that's a good one. So, where do you guys get these recipes from? Um, you know, what, when you work, or? yeah, for, you know, you've been doing this job. You've worked with some of the best cooks that have never actually been cooks in a restaurant, and they teach you stuff. And uh, you know, obviously, we have some friends that own restaurants that give us the you know ideas for the mozzarella logs and to make them from scratch ourselves. But the mac and cheese and the wings and, and the meatloaf. I mean, we we cook for 20 years and. Uh, like I said, there's some really good cooks on the fire department. Listen, so. I came back from Washington, D.C., Georgetown area. There's an Irish pub there that served us a lamb poutine oh, with really? this Irish curry gravy. I brought that recipe back and made it at home, and I was like, this stuff is for real. Yes. So if you want the recipe, I'll look yeah. you up. I like that. Oh, poutine's a great, poutine great, is great good. food. Really I see good. you got it on your menu already. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Saganaki Opa. Yep. Opa. Yeah, we, right. we like to eat, so uh, that, was, that was a big thing with us. And then, uh, Bloody Mary bar? Yep, Every we do Sunday. a Bloody Mary bar on Sundays for football. Uh, that's, a, that's a hit. Um, we're, we're really good for football. Uh, we have TVs everywhere. Uh, Does this include well, Wyandotte? Yes. Wyandotte also. Yeah, we just yeah. opened up in Wyandotte six months ago, uh, downtown Wyandotte, um, our second location. And uh, it's doing great. We love it. We love downtown yeah. Wyandotte. Uh, What's well, not to love? I mean, yes. yeah, it's a, yeah. Great, it's a great town. That's our great home town. office, you know, for yes. Live in the D. Yeah. We've got, right. yeah, exactly. That's right. All the secret formulas come out of that. A lot of stuff going on there, <laughs> for sure. So remind us all where the original Firehouse Pub is located. Uh, original one's in St. Clair Shores. It's on uh, Nine Mile and Greater Mac, uh, just south of Nine Mile off Greater Mac. Uh, we've been there for going on almost four years now. Mm -hmm. And uh, that, that, was our, that was our first one we opened up. Uh, and when we were sitting, sitting together at uh, vacation in Florida, we, three of us were sitting there and figuring out what to do. And uh, when we retired from the fire department, and this popped up, and uh, look at us now. Look at you yeah. now. Two locations. Two locations. Two locations. Two locations. Yep. The business is great. Yeah. All that yeah, good everything's stuff. good. All right. So also, if you want to try out the Firehouse Pub, we are giving away five $25 gift cards. Just go to our Live in the D Facebook page to enter. Or Where do you find that? Is it at the number four? Oh, good That's thing we have a graphic right there just popped up on the screen. <laughs> at four, Live in the D on Facebook. And for contest rules, <laughs> visit clickondetroit.com. Thanks, guys. Thank Thanks you so much. Thank you. And thank you, and thank you for your guys. service as well. Next Absolutely. live.